Okay. Like I tell everybody, if you if you do my program and you go in the army, you're gonna be a rock star. You do my program, you go to SEALs, you're gonna be successful. I can't guarantee you're gonna be a rock star because there's some freaks of nature in SEAL training. Mm -hmm. But okay. you'll you'll be successful, right? But like the army just has different standards. And and I'm really not different standards, it's just because the army's so big, they have officers that are at the minimum PT scores. You're gonna be at the maximum. <sighs> Okay. Okay. And I and is your uh, your programs that PDF that you sent me? Mm -hmm. Okay. I got I got about halfway through that, but I need to do some more reading then. That's why I just sent it to you this morning. Okay. Yeah, it's just really, you know, like you gotta run, man, but your times are already solid. Like I guarantee what are you doing for running right now? Like how how much do you run a week and what have you been doing? Um, I've been doing twice a day and probably like the total mileage right now is probably anywhere between 20 and 30 miles a week, but it's so you, like, a, you're doing twice a day every day. Yeah. Cause I saw that video um, where you were talking to the other guy that wanted to go into seals and you told him to do uh, the, like the relaxed run in the morning and then the uh, intervals in the afternoon. Yeah. But it's every other day. Oh, that's every other day. Mm -hmm. You can't run hard every day. That's why I sent you the program. It ain't a big deal. You just Monday, Wednesday, Friday, you got hard runs in the evening. And then Tuesday, you just have an easy long run. Tuesday, Thursdays, and then Saturday, you have a long run. Just recover, eat a lot of pasta. Okay. Because if you right, like, here's what I would pasta. say like, like, you're swimming an eight minute and you're running a nine minute naturally. That's mm -hmm. how I will put it. As soon as you get on a concerted program, you may be able to drop those run times down. You're 6'3". You may be able to drop them down to 8.30 and get your swim down to seven minutes. Okay. Have you been swimming freestyle intervals or you just been swimming? Um, I've been doing intervals of it, just uh, 50 intervals. So. Okay. So, like, go up to 100 intervals. Like, you'll get that. That swim time will come down by a minute. Okay. But that, you know, like, if you're going to go to Army, I would tell you I wouldn't worry about swimming that much. Mm -hmm. You know, I would put my efforts on running and I wouldn't worry about it. Like, it's a different animal. Yeah. So your advice would be not to go SEALs at all in this mm -hmm. case? Yeah. You have a college degree. I'm going in the Army as an officer. Okay. I'm going to take the officer test. If I don't pass, I'm going to study and I'm going to pass it. Mm -hmm. My dude from San Antonio, dude, you're going to see he struggled on the officer test. I told him, I don't care how long it takes. You're not enlisted. So you better start getting serious about studying for the officer test. So he studied and he passed and he went on me and loves it. Both of my dudes love it. Okay. I had two dudes in the same Ranger class just by accident. Damn. Okay. So I'm going to start looking into that then too. Go look at the videos I got and then you got questions, hit me back. But got like, it. it's him telling the story. Like I did it so that people could see what I'm talking about. And then the other thing is, I, I mean, I don't know if you want to go fly, but flying in the Navy right now is the easiest thing in the world to do. And that's the long money. That's come out and make $300,000, $400,000 a year for the rest of your life. So yeah. if you're sold on being a grunt and being dirty and grimy and all that stuff, then that's fine. But I also tell everybody right now, if you don't look at flying airplanes, you're crazy. Crazy, because you just have to pass the minimum, maximum, and then they give you a flight billet. You go to OCS, you go to flight school. My equipment manager from Illinois is right now, he's in flight school. Mm -hmm. So, you know, I don't know how open you are to that. It's a different lifestyle, right? You're not as physical. You're riding around in planes. But that's to set yourself up for life lifestyle. Mm -hmm. um, the Army Rangers, that stuff is about leadership, great stories for the rest of your life. Uh, your body's going to get beat up. It's a physical job, you know, but if that's who you are, I mean, that's who I was, right? Like that's I, personally what I'm looking for, yeah. Yeah, I don't that's fine. Kind of I just, I throw out options, brother. You do what you do, you know? Got it. I would tell you crazy, though, if you go SEALs when you can go Army. Okay. And with them being behind, you said, like, nine months or a year, that mean if I got into a class, it wouldn't be for January of next year. It might be the the following year there's no there's no way you're getting in in january there's no way dang okay like right now even if you started in 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 june like i would estimate that you won't go 
you won't even go to basic. You might go to basic. I don't think so. You're probably not going to go to basic until March of next year and wouldn't show up to Buds until maybe October of next year. Because you got to go to Bub's Prep for four months, which is they're moving it to San Diego, mm-hmm. but you're in Bud's Prep until you can test out. You'll test out. Your times are good enough. You'll test out. But like you're not going to get there. You're going to go to, let's say you go to basic in June. You're in basic for three months. Come out in August. Go to Bud's Prep. You're at Bud's Prep for a month or two months. Mm-hmm. That's, you know, November now. There's no class in November. So you'll go into PTRR or they'll leave you in Bud's Prep. And you'll class up that following January. That's almost two years from now. Yeah. And I don't think it's going to get better. Like, I don't think, like, I don't think all of a sudden the floodgates are going to open and, and the, the time to get in is going to decrease to zero. They've told me right now they have so many applications. So many people are trying to go SEALs that they're kind of of the opinion, ah, so what? We're good. We keep, you know, the number's still the same. 200 to 250 guys are going to graduate a year. Same number. Same number has been for 70 years. You know, so I don't know what to tell you. I, I don't think it's a, like, every, like my guys, I just talked to a recruiter the other day. He said, man, it's an awful time trying to be a Navy SEAL. Awful time. You know, and I don't, me personally, like, if I see a dude with a Ranger tab, you know, a a second bat, like a full ranger that was in the battalion. I don't look at that dude like he did a less job than I did. Mm -hmm. Like a lot of times, like they doing more work. Rangers, the Green Berets. Green Berets get to go do awesome stuff all the time because they always go on deployment and they're doing foreign internal defense. So you out there working with the people all the time. Yeah. Okay. So, and I, I mean, I just... I, I think the mysticism of SEALs is dramatically overrated, you know. The training is, like, roughly the same, like, difficulty-wise and everything like that? Yeah, I mean, it's the same. It sucks. But dude in ranger school lost 30 pounds. They don't feed you. It's a different kind of animal, right? Mm-hmm. 61 days, no food, okay? So it's just different different things. It's still the same suck, man. Mm-hmm. You know, SEAL training is just long, man. It's six months of long training. Seven, eight months of long training, depending on how you do. But yeah. they're all the same, man. They all come out of the British SAS screener. That's, it's all the same kind of intro tactics. Um, Navy SEALs is a lot more stronger on swimming. Mm-hmm. But you can go into it. I got dudes in the dive team in the Green Berets. All they do is dive. They yeah. do a bunch of other stuff, but like that's the exact same as a Navy SEAL. And they get cool ass camouflage wetsuits. Which <laughs> I was pissed. We got like black wetsuits. They get cool ass camouflage wetsuits in the, in yeah. the right? <laughs> Okay. All right. You got any other questions, Eric? I think for now that's about it. Okay. Watch those videos. You got any more questions? Shoot me an email and uh it. we'll chop it up. All right. Thank you. All right, dude. Let's